Hi, this is a demonstration of IoT air and sound pollution monitoring system. So we have a device that allows us to monitor air and sound pollution at any area. So this system can be mounted at any traffic junction or any area where we need to monitor the air and sound pollution. So this allows us to monitor the values of air and sound pollution monitored over the internet from anywhere in the world. So as you can see, the system uses a 12 volt power supply and this is used to power the Atmega microcontroller. The microcontroller is used to uh, get values from the uh, gas sensor here. This sensor is used to monitor the air quality as well as the noise uh, sensor here and along with that. So we can detect the air quality as well as the noise level and uh, based on that we can transmit the values over the internet to display uh, on the GUI and we have a Wi-Fi modem here which is used to connect to the uh, internet so over the internet we uh, have a IoT Gecko platform so, so we use IoT Gecko to monitor the system over the internet so now we already have a login so we'll just log into the system to check the parameters So we have logged into the system. Let's turn on the circuit now. So let's go to our pollution monitoring section. And uh, the system has started now and it's displaying the data monitored on the uh, LCA display. So as you can see we have uh, both the parameters displayed on the LCD and the same parameters have been updated online over the uh, internet and we are getting it there as you can see so now let's do one thing let's simulate uh, air quality uh, change using some smoke here So let's simulate an air quality change by bringing some smoke near the sensor. So as you can see the uh, air pollution quality or the air quality has uh, changed drastically because we uh, you know introduce smoke near it. So in this way it can uh, detect the uh, air quality. So now let's do one thing let's uh, simulate a uh, traffic sound near the sensor using a speaker So as you can see even the noise pollution was detected and it showed the data over the internet. So this is how the system can easily you know, allow us to monitor remotely the noise as well as, as well as air pollution in any particular area. So this is how the system works. Thank you.